Hey, so what's up everybody? So today <clears throat> I'm out here at the Sacramento River here in Northern California. Today we're gonna go after some trout. There's some really big trout in this river, you guys. Um, I get really pumped when I get to come fish out here. Um, I haven't fished out here in a really long time, but there's a lot of good fish in here, a lot of good steelhead, a lot of good salmon when the salmon are running. Um, I'm gonna be fishing with a guy today, actually my buddy, Philippe. And uh, he's a co-worker of mine, and uh, we're going to see if we can hook up some fish for you guys. All right, take it easy, guys. All right, guys. So today we're fishing the river, which means I'm going to take off this uh, crusty bass bait we were using the other day over at uh, Shasta Lake. So we'll go ahead and take this bad boy off here. And uh, today our options are, I literally stopped by a gas station just because I'm running out of daylight. I don't have time to run back to the house. I, I forgot my whole tackle box today. So... I'm literally fishing out of the gas station today, which is right down the road from the river here. This is basically uh, some suburban trout fishing. We're right in Redding, basically, if I can show you guys. We're right here in Redding. There's buildings all over the place. And uh, this is Fleet, by the way, guys, fishing with him today. And uh, the river's right down here, you guys. So um, it's it stretches from here all the way to Sacramento. Hence the reason why it's called Sacramento River. Anyways, so I'm fishing with a, uh, with a mag spinner and there is still head in this river and this is a still head spinner so a salmon still head spinner it says and then your good old trusty uh panther martin hopefully that's not too blurry for you guys to see there and uh this is a pretty good uh bait for smaller streams i haven't uh fished with it here in the sacramento river too much this one i'm really not sure about uh it's a funky color Usually I fish with a silver and pink. It's got black spots on it. This one's got the black spots on it, but uh, hey, we'll see how it goes. Let's, let's get out there. All right. So you guys, we're walking down here. You guys can see the, the bridge up here. Suburban fishing, got the traffic going above. Let's get down here and this. All right, here we go. Make sure I set my drag. Don't lose another fish like I did at Shasta. A lot of good fish in here, you guys. Doing a walk down this way. See if we can't pick up anything down the way. It's a little bit of a walk. So we're going down this trail now, guys. Oh, and uh, my buddy's walking me through some blackberry bushes. He says there's a good spot up here. We're going to check it out. Whew. Water in our way here. Let's see. <clears throat> Here we go. Oh man, this is exciting, yeah. First fish. Doesn't matter who gets it. Finally picked up one, guys. It's gotta work them slowly. These trout are strong, you guys. Super strong. <clears throat> That's a good one. Look at the colors on this fish. He's working them. He doesn't want to muscle them in too fast. They pop off pretty easy. Shake that hook quick. Ooh, he don't want to come in yet, huh? Oh, there you go. He's starting to break. Oh. <laughs> Let them wear themselves out. Look at that. Fleet hookups. Hooks up first. Story of my life. Look at the colors on that thing. Look at that, you guys. Just 16, 18 inch rainbow. Yep. <clears throat> Bright pink. I mean, that thing is almost chrome. Look at the cheeks on it. Always carry that tool on you guys. I mean, you're out here fishing these trout. You man, you handle them too much, they so end up dying. 
moss fish.